Hey, welcome back to my channel. I'm Shibli, and this video is all about this great DIY with bananas, eggs, olive oil, and a little bit of mayonnaise. If you want shiny, long, healthy hair. Don't forget to smash that subscribe button and hit that bell to be notified when I have more videos. Follow me on Instagram at Shibli Hair Journey and my jewelry line is Shibli.com. This hair is a mess. It's so tangled and dry and brittle, y'all. It's like matted like crazy. All right, first ingredients for this DIY, you're gonna need one banana. And the banana is great for collagens that makes your hair stronger and thicker. And then you're gonna need three eggs, you guys. Um, I got organic brown eggs, it doesn't matter. Eggs promote hair growth, it adds volume to your hair. Eggs add strength to your hair, conditions the hair, moisturize the hair, and prevents dandruff. And bananas, again, are good for the scalp. Bananas are rich in potassium, which softens the hair and adds elasticity. So next is mayonnaise. Um, be careful with mayonnaise. Make for sure when you do use it, um, you rinse out within 24 hours because it can make bacteria breathe in your hair. But mayonnaise is great, you guys. It defines your curls. It helps from frizz. It promotes dark hair color. So make for sure you use extra olive oil, not regular olive oil, but you can use castor oil or coconut oil and it softens the hair from root to tip. So we'll put it in the blender. Great, so we want a really great consistency to a smoothie, not too runny or watery. Looks like it's ready. Now I'm going to take it out, this DIY hair mask and apply it to my dry hair. This is very similar to Cardi B's uh, DIY that she did with her daughter, but except she had avocado and she used um, castor oil and it was eggs and mayonnaise and her hair is almost down, you know, to her butt, like past her back, her natural hair. So this DIY does work. I have been using this for the past three years now and I change it up. Sometimes I don't use the total of three eggs, but I came up with that amount because it's the amount of hair that I have. So that's how much I need to produce enough to make, you know, make it spread throughout my hair. So if your hair is a little bit shorter, a little bit thinner, you might not need three eggs or you might not need a full teaspoon of extra olive oil or mayonnaise. Again, the whole purpose of making this nice DIY, you guys, we are trying to maintain our hair length. We're trying to gain um, shine, moisturize in our hair, and prevent frizz, and get softness and bounce and a lot of volume. So we will see the outcome. Just keep applying it. Make for sure you use all of it. All right, make for sure you don't apply too much directly on the scalp. We don't want to get a lot of buildup on the scalp. We want to keep our scalp nice and healthy. But keep in mind, you have to give yourself a nice three to five minute scalp massage using your fingertips, not scratching your scalp with your nail, fingernails and really enjoy it too. It's gonna stimulate your head so it can prevent more hair growth through your follicles and more blood flow, and that will speed up hair growth. And if your hair gets a little tangled doing it, apply more of the DIY hair mask midway through your hair and start finger detangling. Okay, now it's time for me to speed up this video.
So now I'm basically done applying this whole DIY throughout my whole hair. I'm going to twist my hair in a tight little bun and apply more on the edges and then put this plastic grocery bag. How beautiful is that? <laughs> I'm going to put that on my head so it can really seal in all this DIY hair mask through every strand. I'm going to wait for like an hour, you guys, and boom, let's take it off. An hour has passed. Oof, look at those edges. Yes, it already defined my edges. That frizz is bye-bye. Yes, my hair is still really, really wet and drenched with this DIY all up in it. That's just how you want it. You don't want it to dry up in the hair. You want it to be moist and feeling really soft. Um, it is a bit a little matted and tangled still. I didn't want all of that, but I do see that wow that the curls are getting defined but we're not done yet it's time to rinse this out see the outcome this is shower gel I'm gonna use it's beloved green clay and eucalyptus for the shower y'all this is nice creamy this is what you want to use on your skin and this is what I'm gonna use as a detangler Alba botanica you know i always talk about this i have another video there it is i'll post it right there all about this conditioner so i like to detangle my my hair first before i even shampoo it and wash it so we're gonna rinse it out with room temperature water i never really put hot water in my hair all right now that i rinsed it out and applied the conditioner i'm going to put the shampoo in shaving moisturizer jamaican black castor oil extra strength and restore you and then i'm going to use the kinky curly conditioner after i shampoo to help get all the tangles out i usually comb my hair on the tips and work my way up and i hold my hair as i brush it so i'm not pulling on my hair from my scalp to maintain hair length and this is my shed you guys it's a bit more than what I ex usually have so perfect now that we rinsed it all out everything is all good it is time to go to bed you sis I am so tired so <laughs> as you can see in my eyes so I don't want to catch a cold at night because you know having a wet head I have to apply this um, t-shirt on my hair and then I'm actually going to put like two more things to protect my hair because when it's wet I always catch a cold or I don't feel too good in the morning so I'm going to protect my scalp because I opened up my pores with all this wet head and it takes forever for my hair to dry and I'm going to style it tomorrow and show you guys what it looks like in the morning. Yeah, so smooth, soft. I mean, look at this. This volume, the bounce is so defined. The curls, just what I expected, and it laid down my edges. <laughs> Say bye. See you next time. Bye bye. bye. Give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to our channel. That's right. That's right. Mm -hmm.